What's up? What's what's up? What's good? Thirty days to prosperity. Thirty days to prosperity. What's going on? You already know who it is. It's Mars Magoose. It's my YouTube channel, New Heights. And uh, this is day three of 30 days to prosperity. All right, so when you think of prosperity, I know the main thing that comes to a lot of people's mind is money, money, having things, cars, place to stay, you know, whatever. Having a bunch of women, to some people that's prosperity. To some women having a bunch of men, it's prosperity. She got a nigga for this, a nigga for that. <laughs> but, uh, all those things are extensions of prosperity, of the source, of the one source, of the one idea, the one body consciousness of prosperity. All right. <clears throat> so, I just want to give y'all the metaphysical definition and understanding of what true prosperity is. Because You can feel and be prosperous without these material things. You can feel and be prosperous if you are single, if you are alone. You know. You can feel and be prosperous even if you don't have a hundred thousand dollars in your bank account. It's in it's a state of consciousness, you know, an awareness of a infinite abundance that this universe has when you can tap in. <clears throat> but uh I'm just going to read this metaphysical definition of prosperity. I ain't trying to keep you out for too long. All right. So it says the consciousness that divine mind is inexhaustible support and supply. The consciousness that divine mind is inexhaustible support and supply. The difference between spiritual prosperity and, and the material idea of prosperity is that spiritual prosperity is founded on understanding of the inexhaustible omnipresent substance of spirit as the source of supply. Spirit cannot be exhausted. Spirit can never run out. Spirit can never have to, spirit never has to go back and re-up and wait on the big dog to get straight on some more prosperity so you can get straight. <laughs> you know what I mean? It ain't no, you ain't got to wait. Ain't no plugs you got to go through. Like, it ain't you and the middleman. And then the big dog with the prosperity. You know. The prosperity it starts here. With the consciousness. With your mind. And understanding that. You are in. An energy field. An endless energy field. And. 
the energy around you has the potential to take the shape and form of whatever of whatever you desire to be so come from that understanding um y'all want to read some more y'all want to see more Bet. all right it says man lays hold of the one substance with his mind through understanding and faith uncertainty of riches indicates putting one's trust in the possession of things apart from the consciousness of the substance as the source of all so just getting into the mind frame of prosperity automatically puts you in that field puts you in that puts you in alignment automatically your blessings start falling in place automatically things start lining up for you just through having that consciousness but it just it just, it just don't come by luck you got to decide that i'm going to be you know for like Prosperous. I am prosperous. Prosperity. 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 You know? Prosperity. 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 <laughs> I'm tripping. I got lost. I got caught up real quick. But um, I'm gonna read a little bit more. It says anxiety about supply can be overcome by recognition of the omnipresence of spirit and a, cer- a censoring, excuse me, of faith. In it as the one source of supply. Anxiety about supply can be overcome by a recognition of the omnipresence of spirit substance and a centering of faith in it as the source of supply. It's all around you, it's omnipresent. Spirit is everywhere. Okay? Center your faith. Know. Know that <laughs> it's yours. Know that it's there. Know that it was gonna it's gonna be supplied. Know that it's gonna be given to you, you know. Know that it's gonna be given to you. Know that it's gonna be given to you. Alright. <laughs> but man, I don't think I'm done. I was going to throw the deuces at y'all, but I don't think I'm done. I'm going to read this last, this last little sentence. It's not the last sentence, but this is the last sentence I'm going to read. <clears throat> it says, the one substance is magnified and increased by thanksgiving and praise. The one substance... is magnified and increase by thanksgiving and praise so um basically it's like the same old native american proverb that i use which wolf are you gonna feed you're gonna feed the wolf of poverty or the wolf of prosperity give thanks to the wolf of prosperity Give praise and this shit amplifies. So that's it. That's it. That's all I wanted to put on y'all. Day three, 30 days of prosperity. Peace.